Okay, what I have today is a 2002 Lincoln. It's a town car with a 4.6. I have a customer complaint of running bad. That's about all I got from them. Car's running, you can see no check engine light. So if I go to my scan data, go to codes menu, I have no codes, go to pending, no codes, and these engines, you know, when they're running, they're skipping, you pretty much know you have a coil or a plug breaking down, but you want to try to figure out which one it is, you want to throw eight coils at it, so we'll see where we can go with this. Sometimes these vehicles, you go under data display, you can uh, find specific cylinder misfire. I looked under all of them, and this one unfortunately is not showing me cylinder specific. If I had a, uh, like say an injector problem, you could see injector fault one, one through eight, but from a misfire standpoint, it's just giving me a yes and no. All I have is that right there. So, unfortunately, this car won't give me cylinder specific misfire data on the scan tool. We'll drive it just to confirm it sees a misfire, but we're going to have to go a different route to pinpoint where it's occurring. That's all you're going to get on scan data for this vehicle. There you can see under a low load. I'm probably actually only at 20 miles an hour right now, but it's going back and forth from no to yes. But no check engine light. No cylinder specifics. So you know it's going to be a coil or a plug. Something breaking down because it's intermittent. It's not it only happens under certain load situations so I'm not going to even break out any lab scope stuff I'm going to try to figure out which cylinder is misfiring so other scanners I know the OTC will do it my snap-on will do it Let me pull over here so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to mode 6, which under mine is a generic function. There it is, a little dollar sign looking thing with the 6 mines onboard monitored systems. And there are charts for what all these tests do. It's all kind of generic ID, but on this vehicle I'm looking for test 53. Alright, if you go under engine performance mode 6, gives you, this is a brief description, article beginning, but uh, the hexadecimal number is what the little dollar sign, but we're looking for the misfire monitor, go to mode 6 data for misfire, and it shows, zoom in a little bit, we got total engine misfire, 53 was what we were looking for, cylinder specific. And like I said, they were, there was one through eight. So there is mode, test mode six with the hexadecimal 53. So you see the test ID number component, each one of these lines up with a cylinder, so you have component one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And if you look at my values, you can see I got zero until I go to component three. I have 2,521 misfire counts. All the other ones, like number one, you can see uh, their max value is 655, I have zero, result passed, two passed, and then if I go to three, it splits the screen, but there's my value, and it failed. 
still never set a check engine light but under the mode 6 it captures it so that kind of helps you determine which cylinder you're going with so I'm going to because of the mileage of the car like 109,000 I'm going to sell probably eight spark plugs and one coil to start that should take care of it just figured I'd put this out there help someone you know quit pulling their hair out and try to figure out which one's misfiring so there you go thanks for watching